Do you mind if I take a seat here, Ethan? Thanks. Ethan, I'm worried about you. That you've looked unhappy from the minute that we started doing this project work today. And now you've got your hood up, I can definitely tell something's wrong. It feels to me like you don't want to be seen or like you don't want to be here at all. I can see that something's bothering you, Ethan. I'm just wondering if maybe you're feeling stressed or frustrated or maybe both about this project work. I know when I'm feeling anxious or unsure about something, it can be really difficult to get going. And it's OK. We all feel like that sometimes. Sometimes these feelings can make things seem worse. Is any of this making sense to how you're feeling right now, Ethan? I just, I don't know what I'm supposed to do and everyone else does. I hear you. When you don't know what to do, it's scary, isn't it? It can make you feel alone or like you're never going to get things sorted. But I get it. But we can sort this and you don't have to tackle it on your own. It's something that I can help you with. But I don't know if hiding or ignoring it is going to help you feel better or get this project work done. I just, I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do or how to plan it or literally anything. Well, that's why I'm here, Ethan. It's my job to help you and the rest of the class plan this project work and get it done. So, why don't we get those topics back open on the computer? I want you to have a look through and choose one that interests you the most. I'm going to see how everyone else is doing and if anybody needs any help. And then I'll come back and we can talk through your choice. And then we can make a plan. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, miss.